I'm going to show you how to make a fully powered conduit. If you're here, you already know what a conduit does, how it works. So let's get down to business. Now to make a fully powered conduit, you are going to need a conduit, obviously, and 42 blocks. The blocks have to be prismarine or related prismarine. So that's prismarine, prismarine bricks, dark prismarine and sea lanterns. They have to be full blocks, no slabs, no stairs, no walls. You can make an entire frame out of one of these types of blocks or you can make it mix and match as I have here. It won't interfere with the performance. And to make a fully powered frame, you will also need one extra block. You can make that block anything you like. I recommend a slime block. So let's start making the conduit. Grab whatever of the prismarine blocks you want. I'm going to use prismarine brick and put down five blocks in a row. Put down two more either side of the central one so that you've got a cross shape. Place your extra block right on the center and your conduit on top. Now the reason that I like a slime block is because even if you've got mining fatigue, slime block is an auto break just with your hand. And the conduit itself needs to be completely surrounded by water so it has to be the center block of a 3 by 3 by 3 square. To be fully powered a conduit needs three activator rings, one along each axis. The easiest way to get it started is to make one ring. So we've got one line across. We're going to place one, two, three, and one, two, three on each end, and then five along the top. And there's our conduit working. That's the base level. You do not have to build a full activator ring to start with. So if we get rid of this, we could say do it this way. There we are, we've got 16, it started up again. But to make it fully powered, as I said, we need three rings. So I might make each of them in a different color so that you can see what I'm doing. So we've got the first one. Let's make the second, which is at 90 degrees to the first. And then we make the third coming off the middle of our other two activator rings. There we are, that's three. This is now fully powered. It has a radius of effect of 96 blocks. So that's 96 in each direction and going up and down. And once a conduit is fully powered, any hostile mobs that are in contact with rain or water that get within eight blocks of the conduit will take two hearts of damage every two seconds. So there we are, two fully powered conduits.